Paul Negru was a Christian psychologist and a Baptist pastor in Romania, in Eastern Europe. He endured and survived many years of persecution by a God-hating communist government after the Second World War. He made a significant contribution to humanitarian work and education in Romania after the communists were overthrown. The church he pastored grew until it had to build a 2,000-seat worship centre. Paul Negru was born to peasant farmers in Romania in 1942. When he was a young man, his family's farm was taken from them to become part of the collective farm program of the Romanian Communist Party. His destitute family moved to the capital Bucharest to survive. His father worked on the tramways to enable Paul to go to university. In 1976, Paul graduated as a clinical psychologist and started work in a hospital in the Romanian city of Oradia. He applied his psychological techniques and Christian principles to the treatment of his patients. He was reported to the Romanian secret police who were trying to suppress the Christian religion. In 1982, the Second Baptist Church in Oradia urged him to take up the vacant position of pastor of their church. He gave up his career in clinical psychology and became a Baptist pastor. He and his family were relentlessly persecuted because of his Christian faith. The communist authority sent letters containing false accusations about him to his church members. He endured repeated interrogations. An attempt to set up a car crash meant to kill him. An attempt to electrocute everyone in his home. Threats of violence to his wife and children. And police raids on his home. An examination of communist government records confirms the truth of all these acts of persecution. The persecution was so severe that after years of unrelenting pressure, in 1987 Paul Negru suffered a stroke. He recovered his health while sheltering in isolated country farms. Later that same year, Paul's wife, Delia, also suffered a stroke. Fortunately, she also recovered. In 1989, Romania's communist regime was overthrown by a popular uprising. Paul was now free to pursue further studies. In 1994, he obtained his doctorate in Christian studies at the London Bible College. His church opened a high school and a Bible college under his leadership. The new Romanian government admired his work. They asked him to broaden the teaching program of the Bible college to include training for school teachers and social workers. Paul was happy to agree, and he also set up departments of music and business management. In 1994... The Bible College became Emmanuel University, which offers a high academic standard of education. Graduates hold important positions in both education and business in Romania. Paul Negru and his church also founded a foundation for social care. Orphans, people with disabilities and cancer sufferers were given help. The Romanian government gave Paul Negru's church the land for a hospice and a daycare centre. In 2014, the Bethesda Medical Centre was opened. It provides 10,000 patients a year with treatment from general practitioners, dentists, eye specialists and gynaecologists. A pharmacy provides free medicine to people who cannot afford to pay for it. 
In 2000, Paul Negru received a knighthood from the Romanian government. He also received an honour from Great Britain. Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher presented him with the Torch of Freedom for his courageous stand against oppression when the Communists ruled Romania. We salute Dr. Paul Negru, a Romanian Christian who made a difference. Christians made a difference.